I don't understand. We just have to wait here. If we all three stay in this apartment, we have a really good chance of getting out of this. Oh no, Ray, he wanted to check out the roof. Ray? Why didn't you tell me he was planning on leaving? I didn't know you were in there getting instructions on what to do. Oh, it's not good. This is so very not good. You need to tell me what you know. That guy I saw last night, well, I just saw him again, and he told me we needed to have a talk. Did he tell you what had happened outside? No. Oh, he, he showed me these images, and they were these things that I had seen before. In my sketchbook, I have these drawings of three people. And they're surrounded by darkness, but they're protected. What did he say exactly? He said, if I try hard enough, I can see what's become of everyone. What does that mean? I don't know, but then he said you can stay safe if no one can see you. You'll be safe if they don't know you're here. Hey. Huh? I'm fine. I am sorry. It's, um, it's my head. It has been pounding all day. Um, do you all have any aspirin in your bathroom? Yeah, yeah, it's um, behind the mirror over the sink. Thank you. Okay, um... I let you get me into a situation like this in the first place, I would like to hear a little more than a hello. You'll be safe if you stay. That is not what you said before. There was never any talk of if. You just told me to go home with that guy, Ray. Why? What? Why is that important? I had to. Yes? I had to give you a job I knew you could do. Ray Simpkins needed to make it back to the apartment. He doesn't always make it back to the apartment. What is going on? What is my role in all of this? Now? Unnecessary. Right?